Come. on the blue spot. I'm going to pop this red now, which will clear it up. Next time he pots the black. Nine. I'm potting the black this time. Black will go back onto its normal spot. Red to the right of the pack he'll be playing for. All of a sudden, this is looking like a very good chance. Sixteen. Couple of reds out in the open. Such a good positional player. And he is fantastic to watch. Twenty four. Twenty five. He has an angle on this black to hit the one directly above the the black there, the one at the edge of the pack. He'd play it, but he doesn't quite have the angle this time. So he's moving that one red out that's causing him a problem. Now, definitely at his next visit, try and get onto Both the black feature. half ball to hit the red right at the point of that pyramid of those six Both reds. Feature. Now, if he hits that full ball, he'll spread them far and wide, and he's bound to be on a red in either corner. And that's a shame. He'd be disappointed if not split better than that. It is five reds and five blacks. Four. Can't believe they didn't split better than that the way he hit it. It has happened once before in a frame to win a tournament. Uh, Stephen Hendry was uh, playing Fourth Molly O'Sullivan many, many years ago, and O'Sullivan led. Uh, oh, sorry. Hendry led 8-2, Ronnie O'Sullivan levelled at 8-8, eight, eight, and Hendry made a 147 in the last frame. Now they are perfect. Now he will be going for the 147, trust me. He won't have anything else in his mind but a 147 from now. 49. This has just been a breathtaking performance from Ronnie O'Sullivan all week. He's been mustered. 57. The clearances he's pulled off consistently. Frames really he had no right to win. Makes everything look so easy. 64. Maybe it was somebody trying to get a bet on a 147. He's slightly hampered. He's made 11 147s in tournament play. And this, apart 65. from that one red open ball, is glorious. Now one more red to be sure of winning the frame. And of course the match. And you can really knuckle down to try and treat this crowd to a 147. 73. Well, ladies and gents, stand by your beds. This is an excellent chance. 80. 81. Doesn't have to play the cannon on the red and pink because the red, the bottom red will pot. Could we finish this magnificent week here at the Newport Centre in the Bet Victor Welsh Open? 88. With a 147. It'd be fitting because he's played so 89. well this week. 
brilliant break ball. He just gets high on every ball. That's the key of when you go for a 147, you've got to get high every time. 97. Well, that's 13 of them. Damien Hurst and his friend Mike look on. Could it happen? 105. Could it happen? It's perfect. Now, the fact that he's a decent left-handed player, he might try and get on this and play the left-handed shot. Now, surely he's not going to make a 147 play on a left-handed deep screw, is he? Goodness me. 112. a shot left-handed ladies and gents unbelievable it's on now just this one shot if it gets perfect on the green 120 oh it's gone a bit too far oh this is tricky the blue's in a horrible position for this shot. Come on, White, get past the brown. Brilliant shot. Oh, this is up there with the best 147s he's ever made, if he does get it. Lady praying, we're all praying. Yes. Come on, Ronnie. <laughs> to win a tournament, incredibly, he's even got a wry smile on his face. This is a genius at work. He knows he's got it now. He will definitely get a standing ovation for this one. And playing the last black left handed, Ronnie O'Sullivan, the genius at work, makes a magnificent 147. Greatly appreciated by everybody in the room and Ding Jun Wei. He's won the Bert Victor Well Show for this audience. has went absolutely berserk. A standing ovation throughout the crowd.